Self-healing materials have attracted the attention of many researchers over the last decades. In order to provide satisfactory material properties and outstanding product durability, self-healing has great potential to extend the service life of a material, and this capability has been regarded as an important strategy when designing a sustainable infrastructure. The materials industry is constantly striving to find or invent more and more self-healing materials. Here we have some of them, so let's check them out. For the first time in the world, a Japanese university research team overturned this common knowledge with their development and research of this magical glass. Researchers fabricated this self-healing glass from a new translucent material, polyether theuria. It can return to its original state by simply pressing the cross-section together, even if broken. This feature can be reproduced many times at room temperature, regaining the same strength as before breaking. Polymer chains are large molecular shapes consisting of numerous atoms connected in chains. By nature, polymeric materials are hard and non-easily repairable, but polyether theuria has a structure that allows cracked surfaces to be easily reattached by simply pressing them against each other. This self-healing fabric is innovated by Imperial Motion made out of a proprietary material it calls NanoCure technology. To gain its healing superpowers, the material starts with a nylon ripstop fabric that is sandwiched between two layers of water-resistant silicone. According to Imperial Motion, when the material is punctured, it doesn't actually break. Instead, the nylon threads are just pushed apart. They can be coaxed back together by rubbing the puncture wound with your finger for a few seconds leaving little to no trace that anything was ever wrong. The company cautions that it only really works on small holes and tears. Scientists at the University of Reading have led development of a new material that can repair itself at body temperature. The new polymer material opens the door to new self-healing wound dressings for use in medicine. While self-healing plastics have been developed before, the new material is remarkable because it is safe to humans and works at temperatures as low as 37 degrees Celsius, making it ideal for use in healthcare. The new material, a supramolecular polyurethane, flows like a liquid when cut or scraped, filling in the damage in a couple of hours before its molecules bind together to become solid again. This unique structural material composed of cellular metals that can heal a property useful for recovery of material and strength along the paths of stress in the structural member. This healing cellular metal is a new structural material that can continuously self-repair cracks and redistribute cellular materials within itself at room temperature. The healing and reinforcing properties are enabled by a cellular metal infiltrated with an electrolyte. Upon applying a voltage to the metal, Additional metal is electroplated to heal or strengthen the desired area. The target area and healing capability can be controlled using a tunable insulating coating on the conductive metal. A particularly useful approach to generate self-healable polymers has been the introduction of reversible or exchangeable bonds into the polymer network. The idea behind this is to reconnect the chemical crosslinks which are broken when a material fractures, restoring its integrity. The remarkable self-healing ability of this system could be attributed to two structural features, which are present in this unique crosslinking. Unit 1, the aromatic disulfide which is in constant exchange at room temperature, and Unit 2, two urea groups capable of forming a quadruple H-bond. These two cut pieces of elastomer need to be put in contact for two hours and now they are one. You can pull them apart to check. They behave just like one part. So these are some of the astonishing self-healing materials. If you think this video is informative, do like this video and hit the subscribe button. May science bless you.